Alright, Torture Talk. You know what time it is. It's time for a new album review. And the artist I'm reviewing today is called Ransom. Ransom. Let's provide some backstory for Ransom. Ransom is an artist from Jersey City. Um, he been making music since the early 2000s. Um, him and, the, and uh, this guy called Hitchcock, he was the A-team back then. But I think they split up and then Ransom started doing his own thing. And he came into his own. I think Ransom is one of those, he's one of those hidden gems, the o overlooked overlooked um polished gym i would say but every project he puts out i think is very 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 put together very well and this one this one here is his best project to date um it's actually two projects so it's it's two eps which i would put together and make an album but these all together the first ep is called the director's cut uh it's 20 it's a uh, 10 minutes long with four songs um then he has the second ep let's talk about the first one when the first one director cut four song the master hope fiction based on a true story memento those songs right there all four of those songs are fire every one of them is fire i think that he really put his all into this cd and i think that the production on this one here is something that kept me listening to it repeatedly and I, the, the production whoever is producer whoever produced this album shout out to y'all man y'all did a great job it kind of like it, it, it the thing about this the thing about this the first one was it it, it was it fit him that those songs fit him it wasn't he didn't try to do anything else he elevated himself. When I say rappers need to need to either push themselves to another level or do something different, he I can tell from from the Randy from from the Randy from back in the day to the Randy now, he completely pushed himself to another level. And that's how you have to be in this game. You can't just be one dimensional or one thing. So he's talking about a lot of stuff on this. And it's not just street stuff. He actually sounds a little more intelligent than we used to rap about. So I can see that his bars, he grew as an artist. And that's great. Um, so all 40 songs are phenomenal. Um, then you have the the second the second one, and that's Director's Cut Scene 2. And that has six songs. So all six of these songs, Inception, Glorious Bastard, Hellraiser, Beautiful Mind, Oh My God, uh, Meet Joe Black, and uh, uh, There Will Be Blood. Those songs are phenomenal too. Um, I have no downside about this. The only thing I would say about this is the concepts of what he's talking about in the songs don't really necessarily go with the, the titles of the songs. But I get what he was going with it when he called it the director's cut. So it didn't really have to match. It's just the fact that he tried something different and I appreciated that. Um, as far as the production on the second one, it's the same as the first. Whoever did these beats, whoever did these beats, I mean, I, I have to shout y'all out because y'all did a great job. And he did a great job carrying these songs. A lot of these songs had great samples and the samples, he, he didn't let the samples overshine him. He commanded everything on every one of these beats, every one of them. He didn't come. He didn't come lackluster on any song on this album. Not one. He he delivered on every song, every song. So it's 27 minutes long. You could put them together. That's a whole album if you want. You know what I'm saying? I guess that's what you want to do. But for me, that's what I did, and I kept it on repeat. I listened to it about 10 times, and I kept listening to it. I'm probably gonna listen to it when I get off this uh this review um so i would say i'm giving this album a strong nine and i don't care if if he's not as known as uh, uh kendrick or cole or drake i don't care if he don't have the backing like a bunch of these other artists like the baby and little baby i don't care about none of that i care about the albums and how great they sound and this is a quality album i think that everybody that like this type of hip hop, or even like hip hop in general, you have to hear this. You have to. 
He did his thing. I can't front. It's a strong nine. There's no way around it. You know, I would go as far as even saying this may be, this may be my second, this may be my second best album this year of um out of a uh, out rap album, my second best rap album this year. So um like I said, like, share, subscribe to the page. Um, tell me what y'all think about the album. Leave leave it in the comments. You know what I mean. Um, and that's it. Ransom, director's cut, um, scene one and two. Tell me what y'all think. Tell your family about it.